hey guys what's up welcome back to another vlog it has been a minute and i'm going to explain why but first if you guys are new here my name is ashley i am a licensed hairstylist i do work at a salon here in orlando florida and i do content creation on the side so if you like lifestyle beauty hair related content don't forget to subscribe also don't forget to follow me on instagram ashley nice to see a little bit more behind the scenes and i'm also 35 weeks pregnant <laughs> i am so over it i'm at that point I'm uncomfortable i'm ready to not be pregnant anymore but a little recap of why i've been mia obviously i'm pregnant and i have a full-time job i work at the salon full-time 40 hour plus week and i also am just so 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 tired 24 7 since i got pregnant so it's been really hard for me to do my normal content two videos a week but also recently i lost my sd card it is still currently lost I don't know where the heck it's at i have two whole youtube videos on there that i wanted to edit and like post consistently for you guys and i'm just at this point i've accepted it it's gone i don't know where it's at it's literally the weirdest thing i had it on the kitchen table and then it was gone i don't know if stormy ate it i don't know if ryan accidentally swept it up it fell on the floor and he accidentally like vacuumed it i don't know where it's at but it's gone. I had to buy a SD card overnight so that way I can film something for today because it's been stressing me. I had a whole get ready with me for my baby shower brunch for work and and then I had a whole nesting video part one series that is gone. So I've just accepted at this point and that's why I've been MIA. Um, I've been just waiting to see if it would magically appear and it hasn't so I've just accepted at this point So I'm so sorry for all of you guys who have been missing me and trust me. I miss you guys too. Like It's a lot. <laughs> but anyways, we're just gonna have a nice fresh start And i'm gonna be filming a little day in the life. I'm also going to be filming a what's in my hospital bag today I'm gonna pack everything the nursery is 100% well like it's like 90% done i'm still waiting for her sign to put above her crib and then i'm waiting to get a hamper but like it's pretty much done we finished it yesterday and it is just amazing i just love her room i love her room so much it's my favorite place of the house now and i never want to leave her room it's so cute i'm gonna do a whole nursery tour so i'm just gonna wait to show you guys her room but I do want to film a what's in my hospital bag because that's like one of the last things I need to do. And then my birth plan I'm almost done with. And also my birth playlist, I need to start and finish it because she can come anytime now, basically. Because she's already five pounds, which is insane. And she can keep growing a half a pound a week. So I think she's going to be a pretty big baby, <laughs> I think. I have a nail appointment at 1130, which guys, R.I.P. I'm getting mom nails today. I'm getting mom nails today. I'm cutting them short. And of course, I had to go out with a bang because I broke two nails. I was doing so good not breaking my nails. And yeah, I broke two of them. So of course, I had to go out with a bang. And I'm going to miss my long nails so much. But you know, mom nails, I'm ready for you. I am ready for mom nails. <laughs> you know, we're going to try that out for a bit and see how that goes. And then I'll just grow them out whenever I can, which probably won't be for a really long, long, long time. But that is the plan. Gonna get my nails done. I have to go to Target to return some bins. And I need to see if they have um, the baby registry box because I've been going to every single Target and they're all sold out. So I'm gonna go to a different Target today next to the nail salon and see if they have it. And then also I need to clean up. I need to organize the linen closet. Today's gonna be a chiller day because I am off. So I do need to go to Marshalls to return something too. So we have some things to do. I'm gonna bring a big jug of water with me today and we are gonna head out and start this day. It is getting humid again here in Florida, but I stocked up the delivery service little snack box I have here for them. Since getting pregnant, I've been getting so many deliveries from the baby shower stuff and just stuff we need in general for the baby. So as a thank you, I stocked them up. <laughs> we are looking for a hamper for Riley's room. I really wanted to get something from Marshalls or TJ Maxx, like a boho, but I literally can't find anything. So I think I'm gonna go with this hamper here. It's only $13. Um, and I think it will hopefully go with the colors in her room. So I also got my little baby registry, thank God. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm gonna end up getting this. And I also got a bin to put all her like dirty dishes and to like, wash separately. I also got a dress to wear for Saturday. We're going to a golf event 
And then I also got this cute little plant for her side table for her nursery. So we are doing good. I have to get out of here like really soon to make it to my nail appointment. But I'm so happy I found the hamper here. It was only $13. My hands are still so swollen. I mean, it's gonna be like this until I give birth, but. This way. I can't even, my carpal tunnel, I can't even do what this. Do it? Sure. How do you do that? You gotta watch your skills. What? Sometimes the iPhone quality is just not it. I have mom nails. Do you guys remember when I first started doing YouTube, I had short nails? Wait, now that I'm trying to think, did I have short nails? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I had short nails when I first started my YouTube channel back in 2020. So this brings me back to the good old days. Feels different. My carpal tunnel is so bad, I can't even put my hands in a fist. I can't even like do this to do a cute little photo, but love him shout out to Fi. he's the best i'm gonna miss him i'm taking a break from getting my nails done once i have the baby obviously because i don't know what my schedule is gonna be like so just gel it is and this color is really pretty for spring and also for saint patty's love it so so what time is it it is 12 30. i'm gonna run to the marshals right next to here real quick to return a dress and then um then i'm gonna head home i think that's all i have to do today yeah and then we're gonna work on the hospital bag and i think that's it we'll see i was supposed to return a dress and i ended up now leaving with four new dresses i thought this would be cute for postpartum and for an event that i'm going to this saturday and also just to feel a little cuter for work so really good deal this is $16.99 $16.99 I think this one is $16.99 and then this one is $20 it's so pretty I can wear this postpartum I am so out of breath Stormy you want to say hi to me you want to give me huggies mm, you're the best girl ever in the whole wide world she's getting spayed on Thursday and I'm so sad I feel so bad for her that's gonna be good for you, Storm. Um, before I show you guys everything that I got, I was at Dollar Tree and this lady came up to me. She was so sweet and she told me that she watches my videos, that she's a subscriber, and I literally wanted to cry. I'm in that emotional stage of pregnancy and she was just super sweet and yeah, I literally wanted to cry. So if you're watching this, I should have asked for her name. But if you're watching this, thank you so much for coming up to me, even though I literally look like a balloon. <laughs> literally so out of breath. She was so sweet and I was so happy to meet her and talk to her for a little bit. So now I'm gonna show you guys everything I got. Um, so I went to Target and then I got my nails done and then I went to Dollar Tree and then Marshalls and now I'm home. Of course, my camera's about to die, so I'm gonna run upstairs and get a new battery. <laughs> Ugh. So like I showed you guys in Target, I did get a hamper for Riley's room. It was so hard to find a hamper because I wanted like that boho um, basket type of hamper. And I thought I would find it really easily at Marshalls and TJ Maxx, but it was actually really hard to find. Um, so I ended up just getting this one. It was actually $13. I thought it was pretty cheap. Hopefully it goes with the theme of her room. It's more like boho colors. This is like a taupe color. I feel like it's pretty neutral. Um, and then in here I have a bin. Like I said, I'm gonna use this for her dishes. Her dishes for her dirty stuff to keep separate from like the regular dishes. And then I did get a dress. I didn't try it on, but I think I might return it. I don't know. Just because I found some really good dresses at Marshalls for a lot cheaper. This was $30. It's really cute. I got it in a size medium. I need to try it on. If it looks cute, I might just keep it and save it for postpartum um, in case like we go out or something during postpartum and I have like nothing to wear. Um, Cause you know, during postpartum, it's not like my stomach is gonna go um, the way it was before. I'm still gonna have a little bit of something there. So just to like add coverage, be more comfortable. And then I got this cute little plant for her room to put on her side table. Thought it was really cute. And then let's see what else. And then the rest of the stuff I got was just postpartum and essentials for my hospital bag. I did get two Olipops. I love Olipop. 
Um, I got the orange and then the watermelon and lime. I've never tried this one before, so. so I, that's not postpartum, that's just to have at home. <laughs> I like to treat myself to a healthy soda once in a while because my main focus is water 24 7. It feels so good to be vlogging again, like going shopping and show you guys what I got. It's been a minute, but I'm back. <laughs> also, it feels so weird not to have long nails anymore. Okay, in this bag, it's all like postpartum things. So I got two hand sanitizers. I heard this brand is really good, Purell. I'm like really weird about the ingredients. This one says natural, made with plant-based alcohol. I doubt it's all natural, but whatever. I like this brand though of hand sanitizer. So I'm gonna keep one in the diaper cart downstairs and upstairs. I also got three mini ones to put in the hospital bag, one in the diaper bag, and then one in my like everyday bag, I think. Or yeah, yeah. I also got Listerine. This is to put in my hospital bag, makeup remover. I am planning to bring a little bit of makeup, nothing crazy, just like concealer, a little tinted moisturizer. And like that's it we'll see <laughs> we'll see how it goes and then i have toothpaste deodorant lotion i really needed just a basic lotion this is fragrance free um lysol just in case and i also saw a mini loofah because i am a loofah girly and i've been watching tons of hospital bag videos and just feel like really gross you know after you give birth so this would be nice to feel like nice and clean um, and then this I saw, I don't think I'm going to put this in my hospital bag because I heard, um, once baby is born, you're not really supposed to be wearing like strong scents around them. Um, but I thought this was really cute. I love this brand mix bar. I love their freaking, um, body sprays. So we'll see. <laughs> this one's really good. It's vanilla bourbon. So that is everything I got from Target. And now I'm going to show you guys. The little <laughs> Luke and Stormy are literally just sniffing everything. What are you guys doing? You guys are so nosy. Huh? They know baby's coming because they're very interested. They keep smelling everything. Okay, so that's everything I got from Target. But I want to show you guys what I got from my registry. This is the baby registry gift bag. I went to three different Targets and none of them had it. They were all sold out. So I'm glad that this fourth Target I went to finally had it in stock. So we're just gonna go through here real quick and see what we got. I haven't looked in here yet. My favorite registry box so far has been through Babyless, which is actually the registry that I went through for my baby shower. Um, they sent some really good stuff. Amazon was okay, um, but I would say Babyless. I think Babyless sent me the Dr. Brown bottle, which was nice. Okay, so wow, I feel like I got a lot of stuff in here. So we got Honest Clean Wipes, Travel. We have a little Travel Pee Light. Oh, I thought my camera was about to die. I was going to cry. Um, drift. Um, newborn. Detergent. Yeah, detergent. Which I already have and I've already used for all her stuff. For washing her clothes and all that. This is... Um, let's see. Nursing pad, breast mix, storage bag, samples inside. That's a must. This is a forehead the monitor. Hmm, this is pretty cool. I don't really know what this contains six strips this might be nice for like on the go there's actually some decent stuff in here a lot of stuff baby dove i have triple paste which i have two of these i got gifted for my baby shower actually, i actually might have three of those um oh some pacifier i like the color on that it's like a marbly beige brown color i need to sanitize this obviously I feel like I'm talking really fast because I know this video, this segment is going to be a minute. And let's see, this is Aquaphor mini size. Kendamia, oh, this is nice. I actually just bought the, I actually just bought the full size for our like backup formula in case, you know, breast milk. I don't know if I have to hybrid or something. This is going to be our, hopefully, our go-to formula. It's made in Europe. It's more natural than the stuff that's made here in the USA. Um, I got water wipe sample. Um, ooh, another. Oh, this is a breast pump cleaner wipe. This would be nice for on the go. Um, let's see what else. Stormy. Stormy. What are you doing? You're so nosy, Storm Storm. You know that? You watch it when mommy got. Huh? Look at you. You're so. 
my baby girl. These are diapers from Millie Moon. Never heard of this brand, but we'll try it out. I mostly have Pampers, a little bit of Huggies, and Honest for, di for diapers. Ooh, I did get a Philip Advent bottle. Really nice. Um, dish soap on the go. Palmer stretch marks lotion. Ooh, I got another Dr. Brown anti-colic bottle. It's nice that I have a lot of different brands of bottles because I don't know which one she's gonna like, which one she's gonna take. So it is nice to get like samples of that. And then I just got a bunch of other mini stuff. Maybe a vino lotion, CeraVe moisturizer lotion, um, gripe water, which I think this is for gas. And then boogie wipes and CeraVe wash and shampoo. Yeah, I actually got a lot of stuff from Target. This was probably a really good one too. I think the one from Babylist got me, they gave me like a onesie, a bib, like pretty cool stuff like that this was, this was nice not complaining can't complain you know you get free samples all right i'm gonna throw this in here real quick i had to take some tums after the nail appointment which by the way this is my cute purse got it from amazon it's a wannabe bagatelle is it bagatelle the brand look where i keep my tums i have this little travel size jar here that i got from dollar tree i have one upstairs up by my bedside i have one upstairs by my bedside table i have one in my work bag and then one in my purse if you're pregnant you know what i'm talking about never had i've never had heartburn until i got pregnant now i know what it feels like <laughs> moving on to dollar tree i am making hospital baskets for the nurses at the hospital i saw a tiktok on this girl doing it and i thought it was so cute so i'm gonna do it too and i might just include it in this vlog later today how i make it but i just got some stuff to fill the baskets like little i don't even know decor decorative shreds i got some tissue paper for the nurse baskets and then also i got a hey that's not for you i also got a blue little gift bag because i'm gonna get ryan a little present at the hospital like a little dad present i got him a girl dad hat and then i'm just gonna put like some candy in here some like self-care things <laughs> So yeah, I got a bag for him, got some gummy bears for him, foil, boring. I also got some toothbrush for a hospital bag. This I'm just gonna use at the hospital and throw it away. Don't wanna bring like my nice toothbrush to the hospital. I think it's germs and all that. I think it's kinda gross. I did see this at Dollar Tree and I thought it was so cool because I'm gonna try to do my own meals postpartum. I bought the gel kit and all that. So this was, so I thought this was cool to like wrap your finger with acetone and foil. And then I got more of my favorite flossers, floss picks. I usually buy the big bag at Walmart or Target, but last time I went to Target, they didn't have it. So I just got a little mini one from Dollar Tree. Got some air fresheners. This this scent specifically smells really good. I love anything that smells like men, men cologne, like that type of scent. Um, got a vase to put some like flowers. Lately, I've been making my own little flower bouquet every week from Trader Joe's and I like more simple small flowers so I needed like a smaller vase. Also got another vase which I kind of might which I kind of like more than this one but I bought two just in case. This one was five dollars because Dollar Tree now has um Dollar Tree now has products that are over a dollar twenty five so I thought that was funny. But it's kind of cool. I mean I'm not hating Got a little got a little face mask for Ryan's little gift bag. And that is everything I got from Dollar Tree. And then from Marshall, honestly, was just I was honestly just gonna return the dress and then walk out because I got this dress for the event on Saturday. But you know, I feel like Marshall's and TJ Maxx is way worse than Target for me. Maybe because I have their credit card, I don't know. <laughs> But they just have so much stuff and everything I go in there for, it's like I need this, I need that, and I ended up just getting and then I ended up just getting a lot more things. <laughs> so I got some claw clips. This is for the nurse baskets. What else? This was random, but I want to replace the one that's in my bathroom. This is just a like vanity organizer. I want to put toothpicks, I want to put floss picks, cotton rounds, and then q-tips in here. The only thing is, is that trying to get these stickers off 
is literally a mission and now that i have like short nails it's gonna be even harder but i hate when they do this like why can't they put it on the package i don't know or put it on the bottom so annoying comment down below if you hate that too because it's literally the biggest pet peeve of mine and then i bought some randomly these little skinny rice bar almonds and crackers um little snacks this is gonna be in this is gonna go in my hospital bag for like my little snacks i saw that this type of snack is good for labor um what else i randomly picked this up for the dogs <laughs> they are on kibble again they don't have wet food anymore we have them on this really good kibble um, it's called open farm and you can only purchase it through open farm and i have a subscription so i have that food for them we mix it with greek yogurt and some blueberries and they love it so i just needed a big jug to put their dry food because right now it's in like this little mini one and it's just terrible looking okay now for the fun stuff i got four dresses like i said i want to wear this either for postpartum wear it for work or i can wear it both i'm gonna wear it for like my last couple weeks of work um just to feel like a little better about myself because all i have is leggings t-shirts and that's it and i don't want to commit to any maternity clothes so hopefully i bought these dresses that way i can wear for my maternity leave as well this dress is beautiful on and it was only 20 dollars. this looks like a free people dress storm be quiet <laughs> so pretty only 20 dollars and then i have this dress too hey storm no then i have this dress too this one's a large which maybe i should have got the medium but we'll see maybe i might return this one it might be a little bit too big on me i did try it on and it did look a little big on me but i don't know but yeah that's all i got so that is my little shopping haul <laughs> was not expecting to get like all this stuff but you know how it is i'm also trying to take advantage of like these last few moments to myself before my whole world changes and then i have a little baby girl to be responsible for for my whole life before it all changes obviously for the better i'm gonna have a little bestie and when she gets a little bit older we can go to marshall's together and go shopping and do all the fun things together and not by myself because ryan hates doing stuff like this with me anyways now i'm rambling i'm going to <clears throat> what time is it i'm gonna put all this stuff away it's gonna be three o'clock i need to get it going because ryan is gonna be home like around five so I want to take advantage that he's not home. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to eat a quick lunch. Probably impossible chicken nuggets. And like a green smoothie. That's what I'm feeling right now. I'm going to have a quick lunch. And then put all this away. And then start my hospital bag. I actually think my, I think I might film the hospital bag video next week. Because actually no. I'm going to be busy next week. We'll see. Um... Anyways, anyways, I need to start packing for the hospital bag. That is my main concern today. Lunch is served. I got my impossible vegan chicken nuggets, a couple avocado chips, avocado oil chips that I got from Whole Foods, my ketchup, um, and then I'm going to make a smoothie later <laughs> because I'm craving a smoothie. So I'm going to enjoy this and I'll check in with you guys later. Made pasta. Yum. been a while but i'm pretty much done with everything i need to do today i breath from walking up the stairs um i made a freaking good ass dinner i was supposed to make tacos tonight and then realized i didn't have taco shells i used the same ground turkey i was gonna make for the tacos and made a like ground turkey spaghetti gluten-free it was so good <sighs> out of breath it was literally delicious i ate like two plates i didn't really eat enough today so I needed that and it feels and me and baby girl feel satisfied so good and i have leftovers for work this week which is nice it is 7:43. i did film my hospital bag and i did put it in a luggage so i'm so glad that is done with and i think tonight i'm gonna work on my birth playlist but yeah i'm excited to take a shower get my comfy clothes i haven't showed you guys my nursing baskets yet maybe i can show you guys tonight before i go to bed ryan is downstairs doing dishes 
with the TV on, so it's kind of a little noisy down there, so I don't want to do it um, right now in this moment. Maybe tonight. We'll see. If not, I'll show you guys another video. But that is the update for today. I'm about to hop in the shower and relax today. I have not relaxed at all. And I start my work week tomorrow and it's insane. <laughs> so I will check with you guys later. Showered, makeup's off, lashes off. I feel so fresh and clean. I've worn those, the individual lashes, the clusters for about like five, six days now. I'm trying out a different glue with different lashes and it's lasting a lot longer than the last glue I was using. So I'm really happy about that. But anyways, getting sidetracked. So this is the little nurse basket I made. So I have a million Celsius in front of me. Not for me, for the nurses. So this is kind of, a, it's not done yet. Just, this is kind of what it this is kind of what it looks like so this basket i got from dollar tree and then i just got tissue paper and then i also got like those little shred um like fillers like you saw from the dollar tree haul and i got celsius here i think i might do five celsius we'll see and then these are the clips i got from tj maxx i have these little kind bars and the only thing i'm missing is the eye patches and the little hand lotions. I'm gonna pop those in here too, and then they'll be set. And I'm gonna make a little sign here that says day nurse and then night nurse, day shift, night shift for the nurses. So that is what it looks like. It's not done yet, but it's so cute. No, 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 here I am ruining everything. Yeah. This is the tissue paper I got from Dollar Tree. I'm not gonna use the blue one. I'm gonna use all of it except the blue. I'm gonna put the first layer down here, which is the white. And then I'm gonna do the striped layer. Guys, my hands are so numb, it's really hard to do this. Just like that. And then now I'm going to do the floral let uh, the floral layer right in the middle and i feel like i'm messing it up now just like that and i'm gonna put two bags of this i don't even know what you call it decorated shred just like this now i'm gonna put the celsius in here I think I need to put it like around because the weight of it is going to make it fall. There we go. There we go. And now I'm going to do some of the kind bars. As you can see, I've got little kind bars in here, the Celsius. And then now I'm going to add the claw clips right in the middle and that's what it looks like this is what it looks like from the outside like i said i still have a couple more things to put in here but for now it looks super cute they're really gonna appreciate it and they're gonna hook me up you know what i mean they're gonna give me a lot of attention make sure i'm doing great <laughs> don't forget about me nurses thank you um so that's pretty much it for this vlog so my day is done finally i'm going to lift up my feet finally relax and respond back to some text messages i've been slacking on today because i've been so busy but today was a really good day i got a lot of things done especially the hospital bag that was like my biggest like to do and i also filmed the video which is nice so i have a little bit more content for you guys to see the next video I'm going to do is the nursery tour. I'm so excited about that. The nursery came out perfect. And yeah, I'm just feeling really good today. Not really good, but I'm tired. But mentally, I feel good. And now I have a whole work week starting tomorrow. It's going to be insane. But I'm just counting down the days so I'm done with work and just kind of relax. Hopefully for a little bit before baby girl comes. And then start my journey as a mom. Can't wait. So if you guys enjoyed this, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe down below to help your girl out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.
Thank you.